I'm Lorelai, registered dietitian nutritionist. Welcome to my kitchen. This is going to be a meal prepping video. So let's talk a little bit about meal prep. But first, we have to think about meal planning because I think the best meal prep comes when you actually plan what you're going to make. Meal planning is all about thinking about the meals that you need for the week, your schedule for the week, and what's going to work to help get you through the week. Meal prepping is actually creating some of those components on a single day of your week, or for me, the weekend, so that they're ready to go and I don't have to take as much time on the days to prepare the meals that I have planned. I actually, when I'm meal prepping, think about all three meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, sometimes I even consider snacks, and what my week looks like. So today I just wanted to show you an array of what I did during my meal prep phase. I'm actually not going to show you the cooking of these because most of the recipes that I've done today are already on my channel. So when you're meal prepping, you don't have to make things one at a time. You can get everything going all together. For example, I used the oven for about five different things today. So first of all, I have a stuffed squash. I roasted the squash and then I stuffed it. This is not baked yet, but when I come home one evening, I can just pop it in the oven, give it about 40, 45 minutes to cook, and dinner's gonna be ready and I don't have to babysit it at all. I baked a quiche with a potato crust. So first I baked the crust and then I baked the quiche in the crust. This we actually had for dinner tonight. You can see some of it's gone, but it's also going to make great breakfasts throughout the week. And then I baked a peach crisp. It's just fresh sliced fruit and then you top it with a crumble of, I used whole wheat flour, I used rolled oats, brown sugar, and uh, well, I used butter. So it's not super healthy, but there is a whole grain in here and it is made up of fruit. And honestly, if most of your meals are healthy, dessert is fine. If you've ever heard of sort of the 80-20 rule, if we can get all of our necessary nutrients in healthy foods within about 80% of our calories, the other calories for the day, use them how you want. I made a quinoa salad. Some of the quinoa I stuffed into the squash. Some of the quinoa I made into a salad, which I'm gonna take with me for lunches this week. I also cooked some lentils to put into the stuffed squash, but then with the rest of them, I made a lentil salad, which is also a great dish to bring with me to lunch. So these components actually kind of work together. The other thing I prepped was I baked some tofu. This I want to use in a stir fry this week, but it's going to be so much faster to put this stir fry together for dinner if the tofu is already ready. And I chopped some veggies. So I've got some carrots and some celery and some red pepper. And I've also some of the caramelized onions that I put in the quiche. I saved a few out. And these are going to be in like a noodle stir fry that I'm going to do later on in the week. This is maybe a little fancier than some meal preps need to be, and it took me probably over three hours to get all these components done, but it's going to save me so much time during the week, and I know that what I'm going to be eating is going to be healthy, tasty, and satisfying, so I'm not going to end up reaching for just a bunch of junk food. The peach crisp, which we also ate some of this evening, may end up being breakfast one day. I might even serve it with like a little bit of yogurt or something like that. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. I'd love to hear how you like to meal prep, and I'd also love to hear if you are interested in seeing more meal prep videos. As I mentioned, the recipes for the majority of these are already up on my channel, so I'm gonna leave links in the description for this video. I may at some point create a video where I let you watch me meal prep, but I'll be honest, it can get a little chaotic around here when I do that. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hope this video was helpful. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and join me again next time.